If I was not born a boy and I was walking around the street with dreadlocks, I will be regarded as a thief and a weak smoker. Bonaboy refused if he was not Bonaboy or a magician, and he walked on the street that he would be regarded as something else. Where I come from, if you have drug locks and you are not rich, you will be regarded as a thief. Even if I was rich, driving my Rolls Royce Lamborghini or any luxurious cars, I will always be a red flag. When you have red locks, people just see you to have negative influence. People do not criticize my red locks wholly because I am a boy. Even with my level of fame, people still call me a weak smoker, and I have come to realize that there is nothing I can do rather than just accept the reality of whom I am. It is the same thing for footballers too. There are a lot of footballers who play abroad and make fortunes and come home. They are arrested and almost take their life simple because they have drug locks. When you are young and rich, where I come from, people are regarded you as something else. That's what Bonaboy said. Bonaboy trying to say what Nigerians think about people who carry dreadlocks and the negative side of it that they do not place those people in a positive or in a good manner or way. What they think about them is always bad things. That is why Bonaboy say that even if at his level and fame, people still look at him in one way or the other. So he does not care or mind anybody to accept the reality who he is. That's what Bonaboy said. Because of dreadlock, they will pass judgment for you as if you are not belong to society anymore or you are a different person entirely. That's what Bonaboy said because of his carry dreadlock. Well, let me know your opinion in the comment section and share this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Peace.